Huawei P Smart 2017 Power button not working We need to disassemble the phone Starting with the SIM tray Get your eject tool And pop out the SIM tray Now we need to get our opening tool and pry it in between the back cover and this plastic bezel. Apply a little bit of pressure and it will open up. Go around, starting with the lower part of the phone, and do not remove your back cover just yet. You have a fingerprint sensor here attached to the motherboard by a flex cable, and this needs to be done very carefully. So now it's almost disconnected okay it should be done the camera always sticks to the back so be careful opening this as you can see the camera was up so the back cover is detached and I can already see the problem the power button is uh, broken so we need to solder a new power button in here let's go ahead and disconnect this so remove the black tape and unscrew the screw and now you can get the shield off disconnect the fingerprint sensor let's go ahead and do the same here unscrew You have two screws on the battery shield and uh, the charging flex cable. Disconnect the battery. And now we need to fix this. So, we need to replace this part For this, I am going to lift up this area here and try to bend it I guess you couldn't see anything I was doing so I lifted up the this area, this flex cable here so uh, like that so I guess I don't have the 
Hmm. We got our setup here in place. I am adding little flux to the area I am uh, working on. So and placing this aligned exactly to the pads. Let's see if we can do this. Now we need the hot air gun. So So we have our button in place and we need to use our heat gun. So let's see if I can come closer. Okay, so let's see, is it focusing right? So our power button is working now, we just need to bend this the other way around. You could also order this flex cable and replace it completely. So the phone is starting now and the power button is working. Job done. Yes. Let's get our fingerprint sensor connected. Grab your shield. Press down so it gets in here. So this is not as easy as this should be. So, yes, this is the right way to do it.
get your plastic button in place and try to keep it sideways so it won't fall and now we have a working power button insert the sim tray and power off the phone I hope this video helped if it did you can like comment and subscribe have a good day bye